The first balloon we're going to use to make the base of the head. Inflate the green balloon leaving a 2 inch flat tail. Twist the first 2 inch bubble. Twist the second soft 1 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the second bubble in one lock twist. Twist the third 2 inch bubble. The size of the fourth bubble uh, with a chain of the first three bubbles should be long enough to make the loop around your head. So loop the balloon around your head and measure the size of the fourth bubble. At this point you twist the fourth bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the first four bubbles in one lock twist. That is the base of the head. We split the rest of the balloon on two bubbles of the same size. Uh, plus we need some little flat tail. Twist the fifth soft bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last three bubbles in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is the sixth soft bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last three bubbles in one lock twist. Ok, we have made the base of the head. It is very similar to the sunglasses or cat hat sculpture. Inflate the second green balloon, leaving a 4 inch flat tail. We are going to use it to make a jar. Twist the first soft 1 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the first bubble and one lock twist. Twist the second about 9 inch bubble. Twist the third soft 1 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. Twist the fourth soft 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the fourth bubble in one lock twist. We have made one nostril. Twist the fifth four inch bubble. Twist the sixth soft one inch bubble. Lock both ends of the sixth bubble in one lock twist. Twist the seventh soft 5 inch bubble. Make sure the 7th bubble is the same size as the 4th bubble. Lock both ends of the 7th bubble in one lock twist. We have made the second nostril. Twist the 8th 9 inch bubble. Actually it should be same size as the second bubble. Twist the ninth soft 1 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the ninth bubble in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is a tenth bubble. We don't need it. Cut it off and tie off the end. We have made the jar without the keys. Now we have to attach the jar to the base of the head. Lock the first bubble of the jar balloon with one of the ends of the fourth bubble of the base balloon. Lock the ninth bubble of the jar balloon with the other end of the fourth bubble of the base balloon. Fix all bubbles in proper position. Here's the top view, the side view, the front view, and the bottom view. No 
now we are going to use the white balloon to make the eye bubbles and the teeth. Inflate a white balloon leaving a 5 inch uh, flat tail. Twist the first soft 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the first white bubble in one lock twist. Force the nut of the balloon through the loop to secure the lock. We have made one eye. Later we will attach it to the head. Twist the second white 4 inch bubble. Twist the third white soft 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. Make sure the third white bubble is the same size as the first white bubble. Yes, now I got it right. We have made the second eye. We are going to use the rest of the white balloon to make the teeth. So cut it off nicely, keep the air inside of the balloon and tie off the end. Now uh, let's go back to the eye bubble. Tie off the end and uh, force it through the loop of the third white bubble to secure the lock. Our next step is to attach the eye bubbles to the head. That is a front view. We are going to attach the eye bubble from the back of the head. For the first uh, eye bubble, have way in the loop of the fifth green bubble. For the third white bubble uh, from the back of the head, have way through the loop of the sixth green bubble. Fix all bubbles in proper positions. And that's it. This is uh, front view, this is side view, the top view and the back view. Use a permanent black marker to draw the eyes. We have made the crocodile head without the teeth. Uh, you may also pop the second white bubble, but I would rather to keep it. Now we can uh, use the rest of the white balloon to make the teeth. Uh, there are a couple different ways we can arrange the teeth. Let's twist the first uh, 3 inch bubble. Lock the free end of the white bubble. Uh, with uh, one of the nostrils. Twist the second uh, soft one inch bubble. Twist the third soft one inch bubble. Twist the fourth soft one inch bubble. Lock the free end of the fourth white bubble around the second nostril. Alright, now with the fifth white bubble uh, of the same size as the first white bubble. Cut off the rest of the white balloon and tie off the end. Fix all bubbles in proper position. We have made the crocodile head with uh, front teeth. Here's the front view, the side view, the top view, and the bottom view. You can uh, attach more white bubbles around the jar. Here's Daniel showing us uh, the crocodile's head. This 
the crocodile head can be used as a base uh, to make the dragoon head. Well, it is enough for now. Have fun and happy twisting.